Hi everyone, my name is Matthew Stevens. I'm the VP of Design at the Zebra. We're an insurance comparison tool. Um, I encourage you to check us out. We do a lot of really cool stuff. Um, I wanted to talk to you about the card brainstorming template that I put together. Um, before the quarantine hit, my girlfriend got me this card game. Um, it's called What's Worth Doing. It's from the Experience Institute. Um, and it's a card game meant to help with decision making. Um, it was really helpful for me just to figure out what to prioritize. Um, I liked the idea of um, essentially they have these four cards like I want to make, I care about, I enjoy working with, and you're, you're kind of laying out different options and putting the ones that you like the most between these three cards. I like that concept, it'll, it'll allow me to ideate really quickly by just like bouncing from one card to another to, to generate ideas. Um, so I kind of tweaked it a little bit. Um, and that's kind of what this template is all about. So let me share my screen. Is that possible? Um, yes. Okay. So um, as you see, we have these three cards, um, they read, what are we the best at? What's the most valuable to the customer? And where are we looking to improve? And I think these could probably be changed if you wanted to pretty easily. But the idea is that you start to fill out these cards. Um, so in the example here, what are we the best at? The example I included was just optimization. Um, you can do something like design or, um, yeah, sales or anything really. And then what's most valuable to the customer? Um, I put saving time in here for the example. It could be saving money. It could be whatever the customer gets um, in terms of the value of, that you're providing. Um, and then where are we looking to improve? I think you could tweak this to say, what are we looking to improve? But basically, um, you know, where's the opportunity area here? Um, the example I included here is the home page. Um, and so the idea is that you just put one, one idea per um, card so that all of these are filled out and you put the most important ones here in the middle. Um, and then the idea is to come over to do these framing statements. So essentially taking one concept from each of these cards, you start to fill out the statement of how can we use our blank skills to increase the customer's value of blank in order to improve the blank. Um, and so taking those examples, how can we use our optimization skills to increase the customer's value of saving time in order to improve the home page. Um, and then from there, you kind of, um, you start to brainstorm actual ideas. So that's where this comes in. So maybe A-B test some different um, value related copy or you know, something around saving time on the homepage um, and personalize the value props on the homepage to um, you know, make sure that the people looking to save time are getting that, that copy there. Um, and then the idea is to kind of take those. So, you know, you'll probably, you can have as many or as few as you want. Um, I found that it's pretty easy to just generate these framing statements and then, you know, have five to 10 to choose from, come up with a bunch of different ideas for each one. And then the idea here is to plot them on a effort and priority matrix. Some people would call that effort and impact. Either way, just trying to find these quick wins of low effort, high priority. Um, and then from there, you kind of take those and prioritize them here. And those are your action items coming out of the brainstorming session. Um, and that's pretty much it. Uh, yeah, and that's kind of everything. I included a link down here if you're interested in the, the actual physical cards. Like I said, it's a different game. It's for decision making, not um, brainstorming, but super valuable. I really like it. I think you will too. And uh, hopefully you like my template. Let me know if you have any questions or comments. And um, yeah, have a good day.